The Corn School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by BASF and Pride Seeds. Another thing you talked about was maintaining good soil fertility and especially potassium level. Yeah, right. Uh, potassium is one of the uh, essential nutrients uh, with respect to doing things like opening and closing of stomates uh, on the corn leaves and that's so essential for maintaining high photosynthetic rates under limited water circumstances. And what I was particularly concerned about is the fact that number one, you need adequate potassium and number two, you need to realize that uh, in dry soil situations, the stratification of potassium, high concentrations close to the surface and low concentrations at depth, the kind of thing that can develop with any conservation tillage system, um, that that stratification of nutrients uh, really begins to hurt when there is limited root development near the surface where the highest potassium concentrations are. And so uh, long term in terms of a drought tolerance strategy, we need to think not only about maintaining adequate levels of potassium, but thinking uh, about ways to achieve deeper banding of uh, potassium in order to ensure um, an adequate availability of uh, potassium to the root system that perhaps is going to be concentrated at deeper levels. Big conversation around nitrogen and your key message there was rate is less important than timing. Right, the timing was a very very important um, factor in the results that Indiana Farmer received and basically uh, 2012 was a disappointing uh, period in terms of nitrogen response from side dress application, whereas those producers that had pre-plant or a majority of their nitrogen applied pre-plant uh, fared much better. And so the recommendation essentially going forward is that uh, if we want to have a, a truly sustainable system for nitrogen management in corn, we have to move much more into the direction of a split application, some pre-plant or pre-emerge, followed by some side dress. And I believe that uh, if you're expecting drought, and especially uh, drought that occurs uh, right during the side dress application window, uh, then, it's, then we, we certainly have to realize that there's going to be some reductions in nitrogen availability. And so long term split applications of nitrogen are going to be essential to maintain efficiency, reduce the environmental costs of nitrogen loss, and, um, and improve corn yields. Mm -hmm.